Joe Korea at the fabulous food show with, for me, a special treat. I mean, he doesn't look like a special treat. Tony Anselmo uh, pretty much runs Premier Produce, right. which is one of the largest food purveyors in northeastern Ohio. Right. And he knows all the scuttlebutt and all the behind the scenes. And right. All yeah. of well, n now it's called Premier Produce One. We, uh, we're okay. a statewide company now. We have oh, two yes. other warehouses. So, um, but yeah, I've, I've been doing it my whole life. I grew up in the West Side Market. Oh, and, sure. Uh, sure. That's where actually where I met Michael for the first time and uh, a lot of the other chefs. But, you know, I've been doing it for my entire, I always say I'm the only, uh, what am I, 44-year-old guy with 37 years experience. So, but born, um, born in a produce crate. Born in a produce crate, man. I was the rotten potato. <laughs> and, you know, they, they talk about the chef behind the chef. Right. You really are the the purveyor to the stars well i mean i've been very fortunate i was taught very well by my dad um to you know always demand quality and serve quality because your name's on it yeah and our food scene um you know over the last 18 years that we've been in business premier um it has you know blown up yeah and i always used to joke around with my friends you know michael and, and rocco and and Paul Manila and Eric and those guys, I always say, hey, you guys are only as good as the stuff I bring you. True enough. You know? I mean, there is so, a lot of truth to that. You get lousy berries, you have a lousy dessert. Right. How have you seen uh, the demand for variety of produce change over your years? Huge. You know, um, there's so many different... It, it's funny, like, things went so far for so long, and now, instead of being the perfect tomato, people want... The old school tomato that was a little more lumpy, but man, were they good! Yeah. And man, yeah. did they have flavor. You don't need any salt on them, that kind of thing. People are going back to their old roots. People are eating dandelion. People are eating greens. We used to People get, are eating kale. We used to get sent out to the front lawn before the dogs got you the know. Jigoti. And the jagoti salad. Exactly. Yep. Exactly. Very common. The peasant peasant food has become sophisticated, yep. high end stuff. Yeah. What is the biggest surprise? that you find in terms of requests for a product? I think in mean, the last like three to four years, let's say two to three years, has been kale. You know, okay. growing up, kale was a garnish. Yeah. Nobody ate kale. You put it on a tray you put and then you tray, put the... Or it's, a, it's a part of your garnage or it's part of your... Uh, part of your now, you know, uh, I was fortunate enough, I, I, uh, Jonathan Waxman showed, sure. I went, went to his place with Michael the one time, and I said, man, how do you get that kale so soft? He says, I massage it. And I and jokingly, I go, come on, really? Like steam bath? He goes, no, I literally massage it and make it soft and so you can eat it. And I think we've all noticed that it's, it's, it's a great ingredient to play with. It's been, become huge. Are, you, are we finally returning as we once were? I mean, now you bear, uh, let me convolute the question a little, a little bit. Um, you're getting produce really from all over the country all and over. all over the world. But with that said, are you seeing much of a return to seasonal? I know I'm pushing for it. Yeah. You know, um, you know. Unfortunately, you, you know, you, you have to get lemons and pineapple and stuff from other parts of the world. But locally, you know, I'd love to see these restaurants take the tomato mats salad off the menu during the during the winter. What is the point? Yeah. What is the point? You know, I you mean, know. August. Give me it when it's its best. Absolutely, absolutely. I'm gonna ask you 50 more questions. We'll cut for now. Okay. Tony, thank you so hey, much. Thank A you real for pleasure. Me. Take Appreciate care. It.